the main reason why people choose android over iphone is because of its customizable so let's dive deep and see how we can customize this android phone to look a lot more aesthetic and minimal the first thing to do is to go to the settings the display settings and turn on the dark theme because we don't want light anywhere near us Once that's done, uh, reduce the icon sizes or the font sizes if possible because by default the font sizes are pretty huge and they do not look clean and minimal. Once that's done, go to Play Store and download Niagara Launcher. This is one of the most aesthetic launcher I know as if now and it's also one of the easiest to set up. The setup is pretty easy. You can select the favorite apps that will be shown on the home screen for easy access and everything else will be in the app drawer. Just select the apps that you use frequently to show up on the home screen. Once that's done, enable this launcher as your default launcher and also enable everything else that it asks for. It does not ask for strange permission. So you can just click OK for everything. With that setup, it already looks so much better than it used to, but now it's time to level it up a notch by using a good wallpaper. Wall Candy is the app of choice for me today and I've been using this for the past three years and I am very content with the wallpaper choices this gives. There are better apps out there that you might want to check out, but this is my favorite. Once while you're selecting the wallpaper, make sure that you remember how the layout of the Niagara launcher is to make sure that it looks aesthetically pleasing. So here this does not seem right. So I will flip this image so that it fits better. One amazing thing about Samsung is that it automatically adjusts the theme of the mobile to the wallpaper you are choosing. So it all goes in so well. After this, the next thing you have to do is to change the icon pack to look a lot more clean and minimal. So the two icon packs that I recommend are Zwart and Vicons. Uh, both the links I'll be giving in the description box. One is white minimal icons and the other is black minimal icons. So depending on the wallpaper you are choosing, you can choose any of the two packs and both of them are really amazing and really minimal. So I love the way they look. You can easily update those as your default icon packs by going into the Niagara launcher settings, which you can access by long pressing on the home screen. The best thing about Niagara launcher is that it automatically adjusts the font color depending on the wallpaper you choose. So you don't have to worry about this. If the font color is white, choose the white icon pack, which is Vicons, otherwise the black one. Once your home screen and app drawer everything is set up, the next thing you want to do is to set a good wallpaper for your lock screen as well because you want everything to blend in and look like one whole package. If you are using a Samsung phone, then do this to make the whole setup a little more better. Go to the settings and wallpapers and then turn off apply dark theme on wallpaper. So this will make the wallpaper pop a lot more and it looks better overall. If you are a hardcore minimalist and you don't want to look at any buttons on the screen, then you can go to the settings and change the navigation type to swipe gestures and also turn the actual visual clues off so that no buttons will be visible on the phone and it will look a lot lot more minimal and aesthetic it also looks a lot futuristic in my opinion with this setup you can come up with a lot of different styles for your home screen just by changing the wallpaper and the icon pack the whole look and feel of the cell phone will change here are a few examples for you to check out and for inspiration i'll give the link to all the wallpapers in the description box if you want the same or you can download the wall candy app to find them all yourself that's it for this video i hope you liked it i'll see you in the next one until then peace